than Colin Allred here. I'm completely in awe of the bravery being displayed by the women, men, students, and youth of Iran. In the wake of a regime's brutal use of violence against women, Iranians have come together to fight for freedom in Iran. And it's so important that we as Americans help amplify their voices. And I thank the Iranian American community of North Texas for speaking up in North Texas against this cruel violence. I'm particularly inspired by the bravery shown by young women across Iran who have been putting their lives at risk daily for weeks now to stand up for what they believe in. The resiliency of the Iranian people shines as a profound example of the way a community, when faced with such violence, can come together and fight for basic human rights. I've watched with deep concern over the years as Iranians who use their voice to protest their government have been met with violence and state-sanctioned terrorism. And as a member of the House Foreign Affairs Committee, I'm committed to working with my colleagues to ensure that there is security both at home and abroad. And I'll always support those fighting for freedom from oppressive regimes all around the world, including in Iran. That's why myself and a bipartisan majority of Congress support the Iranian people's desire for a democratic and secure government and condemn the violations of human rights by the Iranian government. Women's rights are human rights, and it's important and more important now than ever that we speak up and amplify the voices of those who can't be heard around the world. Thank you so much.